We finally back with some up-to-date gameplay. I'm in another online franchise league with my cousin. And he's been hyping me up, telling everybody I'm nice and all this. And I'm like, bro, I'm, I'm decent. You know what I'm saying? I'm not the best in the world, but you know your fans gonna ride for you. So big ups to my cousin Quay. And this one for him. I ended up getting in this league he was telling me about with the Chargers, as you see. In the first dude I play, dude, little old ape, whatever one his homeboy with the moves on him right there. My apologies, not little homeboys, but you know, one of the homeboys in the, in the group chat or whatever. So we all rocking, and he got the 49ers, so I'm pissed that I can't get my squad, because everybody know I'm a 49 er fan. Like, I got 49 PS5, glasses, everything. Anything you can think of, I try to get as much 49er gear as possible. But I digress. Anyway, dude butchered my team. Like, he got Kyler Murray at, at quarterback. He got uh, Carson Wentz at quarterback. He had DK Metcalf at wide receiver. I'm like, oh, nah, bro. Like, you doing too much. You got way too many ops on the squad. You lose all respect when you do that. Like, if you'd have kept it somewhat traditional, I, I understand, you know, we a lot of trades that you ain't going away, bro. Kyler Murray didn't do nothing. He did the right thing by getting him out of the game because his play style changed once he got him out of there. For some reason, he kept trying to run to the outside. Like, bro, this ain't Madden 21 or whatever. Like, I don't know what you thought this was, but it's not that simple. Bottom line, I'm offended that you butchered my team and got all these ops on the squad. You gotta take this L. I got lucky right there. I definitely got bailed out. But you gotta take this L because you messed my team up. And you know, I ain't played in a while at this point in the game or whatever. I just got in the league, you know, I, my hands, I got pressure on me because my cousin been bigging me up, saying I'm all this and that, whatever. I'm like, I can't lose this first game. And then the dude got my, my favorite team. I, I can't lose, like it's just all on me. So the group been waiting for this video in the rest of the games that I've played in this league. I've been holding off, I don't know, been doing a whole bunch of other stuff. But I'm like, all right, let me finally get this out so everybody can start seeing these games. Cause I got like seven gameplays. I didn't win the championship in this one, uh, you know, spoiler alert, whatever. But it's, it's some comp in there, you know what I'm saying? Everybody cool in the group. So we all be chilling, you know, chopping it up in the, in the group chat, talking about different stuff. But dude, I don't, I don't know, man. Like he, he just wasn't getting it, getting it done. Maybe Matt not his game. Maybe it was just, you know, it was a different game style that he wasn't used to. I, I'm not sure what was going on. But <laughs> come on, DK in a 49er suit? Nah, nah, I ain't gonna cap. I definitely did want us to draft DK when he was in college. When you coming out, whatever. Him, AJ Brown, Debo, and all that good stuff. But uh, we didn't get him. He was the ops, so forget him. But I'm, I'm, I'm gonna need that from you, bro. Like, I don't know who you was passing it to, but clearly you ain't want the ball, so I might as well take it and go run the squad. Because again, you done butchered my squad and got all these ops on the squad, bro. Like, it's ridiculous. I don't know who my, my team was trash this year. I did like it, because, you know, once you put your little spin on the trades and the free agency market, you get, you know, get a liking to your squad. And I was, I was feeling this team. Didn't turn out how I wanted it to be at the end, but I felt like Herbert should have been a little faster. In this particular season, I didn't really know a lot of stuff about franchise where you could update people and, well not update, upgrade your players, you can train certain ones, you could change the abilities on the superstar. I didn't know none of this stuff. So like, I'm coming at a complete disadvantage because I normally don't play franchise. And when I was playing in that other league, none of them said anything about it either. You know, why tell somebody an advantage we just <laughs> oh my god what's that george pickens boy then they got his head blown off if anything you want to have whatever advantage you could possibly have going against somebody instead of even in the playing field because like why would you want to make your game Fight. tougher that's the wrong give me number. that I, I baited him so perfectly right there he thought i was coming in for the blitz nah bro we right there dude had like four picks this game huh Something like that, I don't know. I don't even know who that was. Like Gilliam or whatever the heck his name is. Cause I didn't really do too many trades, but I, I liked where my team was at. Come on, Brown, you gotta knock him down, bro. 
he's supposed to get that sack. Glad he, well, he still got it, but he probably would have fumbled when he just blitzed him like that. So we proceed to continue carving him up like a turkey, man. Like, my passes is on point. Offense doing good. Defense holding him down. Look at that pass. Like, come on, Evan Eagles. You got you to gotta not step out of bounds and get that touchdown, bro. I say, you know what? Evan Ingram got us down here, so let me let him finish it off with a nice little touchdown pass. Dude, bobbling it off his helmet and stuff. Like, get your head in the game, bro. I need you to score these TD. So now we up 17 nothing comfortably. Got the ball back again. Went, oh, halftime. And that was probably his best defensive play right there. He had Sauce Gardner, too. Like, his squad was nice. It just, I, I don't know, man. Like, I don't, I don't, I couldn't tell you <laughs> what happened. You got Nick Bosa just diving. I don't know. Like, I don't know what he had going on. He still had Tayshawn Gibson on the squad though. Like that's crazy. He's slow as hell. Look at the move. Come on now. We out here. We running that cheese, baby. Eckler trash. I mean, yeah, he break tackles. He, he good, but he just ain't got the speed for me. And Madden, everybody knows it's all about speed. It don't care. You can have like a. 99 overall rated player but if he like a 76 speed like he gonna be trash give me that bro he all under throwing passes now i'm not gonna hold you he does score i think once <laughs> maybe once i messed up on a pass that he threw and i took the wrong even trying to tackle him and dude just was out but eckler just out there doing the numbers we moving the ball at will, man. Like, it's nothing he can really do against my offense. I settle for the three. You know, no need chancing it and changing the momentum, giving him the chance to come back. Nah, we gonna keep the pressure on, make it a four score game, and he gotta deal with it. But he go with a nice pass by him, good read. And then George Pickens out. I'm not sure who number five was for that last play, but look at George Pickens. Maybe that wasn't him that got cracked earlier. I'm not sure. But anyway, he scored, so maybe he feel a little confident now to knock the momentum down. I should get out, man. Oh my god, if he would have just actually held the block. That was bad running by me, man. I, I should have just cut it to the outside, let him pick up the block, and then took it. Well, I don't know who that fullback is, but I do use fullbacks, so I always try to get uh, my boy Kyle Juszczyk. Oh, and Jimmy Ward, RIP to his 49er what? career. Man, play for the Texas now, but he, he came out there looking nice right here, man. He's slow as hell too, 88 speed. So like, if he'd have had like 90 something, he probably would've took it to the out. Look at him, he carved me up now. He got confidence. Like, yeah, I, I got this little post route, bro, you're not gonna keep doing that. It just, I'm gonna make adjustments. That's just something that I've always done in Madden, which is why normally in the fourth quarter, I turn up. Cause by that time, you done pulled out all the tricks that you run and I know what's going on. I oh, did score again. What? Yeah, that's crazy. That was crazy. <laughs> that was crazy. We pushed him in there. So now, look, even he got some momentum going up. I'm guessing he's feeling much better about himself. But we still running this offense, man. Like, it's it's nothing. My boy Sky Moore got hurt on a run play, and he's a wide receiver. Like, how you get hurt, bro? The injuries and Madden in this franchise? Ridiculous. There's no way in hell people should be getting hurt as often as they actually do. Look at the running skills, bro. I'm finding the holes, hitting the acceleration when I'm supposed to. Now, he should have ran him over. He's standing in the flat foot. I'm coming at full speed. Let's go. Let's go. Who is that? Oh, Calvin Ridley. Yeah, I had a decent team, man. I had uh, Calvin Ridley. Who else we had? Mike Williams. He was a little too slow for me. I ended up trading him. I think I had Courtney Sutton. Is this the Yeah, I had Courtney Sutton. I'm not sure. Evan Ingram. I didn't want to go too crazy with the trades and all that. You know what I'm saying? Like, I was decent. I was happy with the squad I had, and I felt like they was capable enough to put points up, which clearly 31 points in the fourth so far, but 30 points, that's that's what the case is. My defense was nice, too. We already had a whole bunch of stars. Khalil Mack, uh, Derwin James, Asante Samuel Jr., uh, Joey Bosa, of course. Can't forget about him. I know he can catch that. Nah. I don't know, maybe he did. He probably did catch that. But he's still going for that post route. Like, bro, we making adjustments, man. You're not going to keep running the same joint. So now, since you think we trash you, let's go. We're going to run the score. And again, you disrespected my team. We out of here. Stop. I want to, ooh, boy, thank God he ain't fumbled. But I wanted to just hit him with the moves and be gone. 
who is that, CJ Spiller? I'm, I'm not sure what his first name is. But I do remember a Spiller from the, like, the Bills back in the day. The offense is just immaculate right now, bro. Like, anything we try is good. Wide open. Wide open. Y'all pretty much see the outcome of this game. It ain't no coming back on his end. I think we he ended up throwing another interception. Oh, yeah, from this point, we just turned up. Stole with my boy. I know he was pissed right there because he had a nice pass. We just dropped the ball. But from this point, I think after this play, it just get bad. Go, yep, it just go bad for him. It was just touchdown after touchdown. Let me get that. Take it to the crib, baby. D4, RIP to his career because he don't play no more. But yeah, from this point, it was just like, all right, I got to disrespect him because he's, again, he messed my team up. But that's this video, y'all. We just going to keep getting interceptions and keep putting the ball in the paint because that's what we do. I know he was pissed like, yo, this nigga's cheating. I'm, I'm not. I'm really not. This is just one of them games, man. Madden all about momentum and how you do things. Nice little cut right there. We in there for the touchdown. Does he throw another pick? Anyways, let me get that. My man Gilliam again. I think that's Gilliam. I don't know his name. But another pick, bro. Like, he just couldn't stop it. Instead of running the clock out, no. We want another touchdown. Let me get that. Huff out there looking like a piece of trash, even though that's my man. Tongue and Tiger. Another pick. Yo, you got to be out your mind. Look at the score. I scored 21 points in less than a minute. I knew he was pissed. But that's the game, y'all. Hope y'all enjoyed it. And I'll see you on the next one.